hallelujah shalom blessings to you child of god blessings to you family welcome to this session god bless you all in the name of jesus i am so excited i'm so happy this is another day that the lord has given us the permission that the lord has given us the opportunity to see so that we should rejoice and be glad in it i urge you again don't let anything steal your joy the Bible says, with joy shall you draw from the wells of salvation. Anything you want to receive with, from God, any blessing, any miracle, you only receive it when you are joyful. You only receive it when you are happy. You only receive it when your heart is at peace. So pray to God to give you his joy and don't let anything make you to lose your peace. Don't let anything cause you, you know, not to be joyful hallelujah hallelujah welcome back family welcome back and if you're watching me for your very first time this is god's word with lady risa i share the word of god prophetic prayer sessions and i wouldn't want you to miss on any of this session so please do subscribe may the lord bless you as you do so hallelujah this is a direct word from god to someone genesis chapter 12 verse 3 the lord says i will bless those who bless you and whoever curses you i will curse and all peoples on earth will be blessed through you. It is short yet impactful. In the book of Daniel chapter 9, the Bible says, Daniel, by the study of the books, understood, understood that the children of God had been in desolation longer than they ought to. He understood by the study of the books. When you open the, your Bible, you see what is written of you in the Bible, what the Lord says about you in the Bible. So God has told you, that he will bless those who bless you and curse those who curse you. And that all the people on earth will be blessed through you. That is a direct word to you. For you to walk in the blessings of God, you need the knowledge. You need the knowledge. That's why you study the word. To get the knowledge. When you receive the knowledge about who you are, who God wants you to be, what God wants you to be doing from there, it's easier for you to attract the blessings because you already know who you are. You study the word in order to discover more of who you are so that you will be able to manifest it. You are blessed. When someone says you are blessed, in other words, the person is telling you the power to succeed has been conferred on you. Everything you do, you are going to succeed. It means the supernatural ability of God is with you, causing everything you do to be successful. So when they say you are blessed next time, you already know that this is what it means. Hallelujah. That is why Esau cried when he came and re realized that the blessings had been released to his brother Jacob and there was no blessing left for him. Because he knew that in order to succeed in life, you need the blessing. In order to be successful with what the assignment that God has given you, what you are being called to do, you need a blessing from God. You need that supernatural ability to come on your natural ability in order to make success easier, in order to make life easier for you. So the Lord is telling you today that you are blessed. It's a direct word for you. It's a direct word to you. Receive it, walk in it, walk in your blessings in the name of Jesus. Amen. Now may the Lord bless you and may he keep you. May he cause his face to shine upon you and may he be gracious to you. May the Lord look kindly on you and grant you his peace. Shalom.